In the Department of Mid Yorkshire, we have a vision of having a fully integrated, multi professional workforce delivering the highest quality service that we can. Uh, our advanced practitioner reporting radiographer colleagues are key components of that, that workforce. It allows us to offer uh, facets of our service that we just wouldn't be able to provide with the radiologist workforce that we have available. Okay, keep still now. If a patient comes for an x ray, what the patient wants is not the x-ray as quickly as they can, they want the answer as quickly as they can. Advanced practice within reporting helps to deliver that. We should not be practicing in isolation either as radiologists or radiographers. There should be an integrated uh, mix of working across the two professions. We can make a big difference in terms of patient pathways by putting a radiographer with specialist skills early in the patient journey and working within the multidisciplinary team. One of the key issues that we needed to face initially was to consider what the reporter radiographer was doing and where that sat in the patient journey. So as a radiographer who was x-raying patients, I'd often be, look at the x-rays, I knew exactly what was going on, but I'd report it the next day. So actually the patient wasn't being influenced by my knowledge and skills. The way things have changed more recently is we've become a core member of that multidisciplinary team, primarily now providing an immediate report to the clinicians, providing immediate report to patients, giving patients instructions and advice as well. The way our service works is the patient goes to the radiology department, they have their x-ray performed and whilst they're still within radiology, the reporting radiographers will, will have a look at the x-rays and will do a hot report before the patient comes back to the ED, which means we've reduced significantly the number of misses, um, we're not having to call back as many patients at a delayed stage, so from a patient point of view, it's improved both care and quality of care. So, it's obviously just an AP projection of the left ankle. There's a fracture of the tibia. The radiographers can't report from day one. It's a postgraduate skill they learn at some point in their career when they're aspirational advanced practitioners. Um, that requires postgraduate education. We look at doing the postgraduate certificate in MSK image interpretation and then we follow that with the postgraduate diploma in chest and abdominal reporting. You've got the clinical history there in terms of referral. Also as part of that we like to then develop them further by putting them on the research module and completing their master's dissertation at the local university. In terms of the scope of reporting radiographer practice, it is based uh, initially on the, sort of the framework that we have set up uh, for qualifications initially, in terms of going through the relevant qualification processes for the reporting radiographer to, to start to report here. And then we apply our own level of uh, assessment on top of that before we, we allow sort of autonomous practice within the, within the department. Uh, that works in conjunction with our radiologist governance, so we apply the same principles of peer review, of discrepancies and uh, radiology education and learning meetings. So we're doing it for chest pain, we've ruled out pneumothorax, pleural effusion, infection. Within the governance structure, the main thing we do on a day-to-day -day basis is we are involved in a peer review and what we ensure every reporter does is look at a number of cases before their reporting session with somebody within the team by looking at the previous day's work so that if we do find a discrepancy we've got a nice time frame within to recall the patient and to do something about the discrepancy. Radiographers reporting radiographs is nothing new but embedding it in practice is what we need to do is actually make sure individuals are utilised to their full scope. We know from research that the ability of the clinicians is improved by adding our report into the patient pathway. We've got research that shows immediate interpretations can reduce spend, can reduce journey times, can actually reduce the number of patients admitted to hospital and bed stays. Here at Mid Yorks, it's taken the best part of 15 years from conception to get to the point that we are now. Some of the challenges that need to be called out are around perceptions, and that's perceptions of quality, mainly from the radiologist workforce, from clinical workforce, and that's something that should be tackled, tackled head on. We view our radiographer colleagues as not replacing consultant radiologists, but as complementing consultant radiologists uh, and working as part of the team to deliver the highest quality service that we can together.